all with it. Uh, how come it won't start? You at least go up it, even if you don't go down it. You can go uh, around here like we came down before, but at least go up one. It's harder down. It's harder to go down because uh, the front wants to dig in. So there's tracks already coming down. If you see a track, just stick, stay in it. You can go out of them. You just have to have a lot of momentum be on the throttle hard. You can't coast down it because the sand is too deep. So, did you notice when I was coming down, I was even on the throttle? So, even if you don't come down, I want you to at least go up one time. That one over there is probably the easiest one. Or the one, like, in between these two, that nobody's gone on. See this one right here? That looks pretty easy. And then when you get to the top, just cut it to the right. You're still going to need to stay on the throttle, but just lean in. You can dab your foot. You can stay on the throttle. In deep sand, you're going to get used to the wheel spinning. Did you notice like a lot of sand kicking out yeah. from behind me? So you're going to have to do the same. You have to be so hard on the throttle, it's like you're just like kicking out sand. But if you don't do that, you're going to get bogged down. So just stay on the throttle the whole time. And then just, this one right here has no tracks on it. It would be easy to coast down right here, this one. But if you don't want to do it, just go around over there and come back down. Whatever you do, you have to keep your momentum and you have to stay on the throttle the whole time. So even when you get to the top and you're turning, you still have to be on the throttle. Like, did you notice when I was turning, did you see a lot of sand kicking up? So just ride it like that, like just on the throttle. Probably first. First or second. If you're in second, then you need to have some pretty good speed. You're gonna follow me? Oh, okay. 